Hey, it's Emma from the tourism and marketing team. Emma, what's the, the story behind the Salford Museum? Right? Uh, well, we work for the tourism marketing, which uh, our idea is to promote the city to visitors and to residents. Uh, and this is part of our culture and heritage plan. So, musical heritage is a three to five year campaign, of which the music map was stage one. And yeah, the idea, because it's a 3D map, we've got actual cutouts that you can pick up and take off. So if there's a really popular person, then somebody may have to be called and taken off. And so the idea is that hopefully people can find out all about the heritage of the city, everything that's gone on in the past, but also everything that's happening now and in the future. So that's why we've got a mix of things on there from the 1950s up until now with the Ting Tings. Yeah, the concept yeah. of this, where did, where did it come from? Why did well, you try why did I you kind of knew to... that there were uh, lots of famous people that hail from Salford and weren't from Manchester but the terminology was always being used about of, of Manchester music you know Salford's kind of not been kind of rated as highly in terms of culture and its influence on the music scene so um, we just wanted to kind of re redress the balance really. Um, so the exhibition is on for a year and the map is on for a year. Bands can be cold well, yes, that's the idea. We've got some postcards that we want people to fill in, have their say, uh, see if they let us know that if there's somebody we've missed or somebody they think is up and coming. And so it's hopefully quite flexible. We can keep it moving over the, the three to five years we're trying to promote the music. So if my single sells, <laughs> if my first single sells yeah. 600, mm -hmm. 800,000, then... Mm -hmm. Oh, well, that's quite possible. Yeah, we'll have to do a little cardboard cutout of you. <laughs> see where we can put you. But, you know, that's down to the public. If they have their say and they say they want you on there, then... So it's completely democratic. Absolutely. Fantastic. Thank you, Emma.